friends. Do you want to see how my mommy gets my curls? Does get my curls my so cute? I wanna find them beautiful. Keep watch. So friends, I did uh, wet her hair in the sink and add some conditioner just because I like the hair to be nice and wet. So I'm going to be using this Aunt Jackie's Curl Maintenance in her hair. In another video, her wash and go video, you would have seen me use this Baby Girl's Curls. And I do like how this stuff, you know, curls her hair. But I find that this Curl Maintenance works so much better on her hair. Whereas the Baby Girl's Curls works amazingly on safaris. So when I want to get this nice defined curl, I do section her hair off so I can get every strand, like coat every strand with this cream. And I do use my spray bottle that has coconut oil, filtered water, and conditioner in it. And after I use that spray bottle, I do make sure I detangle it to get all the knots out. And then I'm going to add the cream. And I am pretty heavy handed friends, like, yeah, I use a lot. And that's the key to this, the way that I do it anyways to define her curls, is finding the right cream, the one that makes her curls pop, the one that defines the curls. That's all I use. I know a lot of people will use like oil afterwards, but I don't I don't use that. And then I finally got a Demnin brush, if that's how you say it. <laughs> but, you know, uh, some of you guys have said in my comments, I need to get this brush. And I was like, you know, yeah, yeah, I'll get it. I'll get it. I didn't think it was a must, but after I got it, friends, oh my goodness. This brush like totally does define the curls. It's so amazing and I'm like slapping myself because I'm like Why did you not get it sooner when your friends were telling you? But I'm gonna show you guys how that works in a minute So the key thing friends to make sure that you get a nice defined curl is like I said You want to find a really good defining curl cream and also you want to make sure that you are sectioning it like make making sure that every strand is getting that cream in there just because you know, it's not going to define the curls nicely if you are just putting it all over the head without sectioning it off and getting all the strands. That's what I found anyways. When I don't section it off and I just put all that, you know, um, cream in the hair without sectioning it, then it's just, you know, it, it, you'll see some curl definition, but not you won't see it all over the hair and it will be more bigger and fluffier and I do sometimes like to do it big and fluffy and I so friends really all that I do just to get that nice defined curl is just to section her hair off and then add the spray bottle and then add the cream and then that's all I do and you do want to make sure that the hair is wet when you're before you add that cream. Where with Sakura's hair, I have to make sure it's wet anyways to get that nice defined curl. But with Safari's hair, I can sometimes just use a cream and add it to her hair and the curls will pop. But I do notice that if I do add water first, a little bit on Safari's hair, and then add the cream, it does make it pop even more. So friends, now I'm going to do like a split kind of test. I'm going to use the Demnin brush on one side of the hair and then I'm going to use the wide tooth comb on the other just to show you guys the difference in how it brings out the curls. Just in case, you know, you're thinking about, about buying the brush but you weren't sure because, I don't know, you just don't want to spend the money or really care to go look for it. But this is just to show you that you might want to spend the money or might want to spend the time to go look for one of the brushes because I really do think that it works. I really hope you guys can see this on camera see the difference that it brings out but so friends it looks like when you're like brushing with the brush it's like bringing those curls together like bunching more of those curls together rather than when you're like combing it with the wide tooth comb it just looks like it's all spreading it apart and not like really getting those curls defined or bringing them together and maybe that's what, what it is it's like if you get those curls closer together and comb them out it just defines the curl more i don't know what the science behind this comb this brush is but if you notice it does make a difference so friends out there who are using this brush what do you guys think of this brush let us know in the comments below do you really think that it defines the curls what are your thoughts on it and how do you use it like i was first doing bigger sections and then close to the end i thought oh you know what i should try smaller sections that might help define the curl more how are you guys brushing it let me know in the comments below so when I get to the top, I like to just split it to the side. You could do it in the middle or just going back, but I like to split mine to the side normally. And I make sure to comb it to the side that it's go going to be on. So you wanna make sure that you do that. 
So friends, this is what it looks like still wet and the curls are looking cute and pretty defined. And it does get more curlier and more cuter when it is dry. And it took us about almost two and a half hours for it to dry. And there it is dry. So there is a lot of shrinkage, but that's okay. And it is so cute, so defined. I love it. She loved it. Oh yes, friends, and I also wanted to mention I'm noticing Socorro's curl pattern is changing. She used to have really curly hair, like curlier than she has now, but in the top middle of her head, it is like her curls are not as curly as they used to be. And I don't know if it's going to happen throughout her whole hair or if it's just going to happen in that spot, like just right in the middle of her head. And at first I was, I was actually really upset because I, I like love the really defined curl but after you know I'm getting used to it and plus she does still have a lot of curl definition throughout her hair so don't be thrown off or worried if you notice her hair isn't as curly as it you know used to be because I was worried and thought I was doing something wrong but upon researching I realized that's just what happens when our little ones get older. So my friends, I hope you liked this video and I hope it helped you out in some way. If it did, please give us a thumbs up and hey, subscribe to our channel for more videos. We love you friends. Bye.